my face in front of camera, my face in front of camera. Welcome back to Bruce Workshop. Today I want to share some printing tips with ABS without enclosure. But of course, with enclosure is better, but without enclosure is also possible to print out without warpings. Or a huge change on minimize the warping issue. So on the screen, you can see that is the M, uh, Prusa MK32 or 2.5 new extruder part. It looks similar to the old one. So the main difference is the front fan is tilted to some to a certain angle, make it all more airflow to the the hot end, so easy to make it print out more beautifully. So and oh, another different is the heat sink part. They will also got more fan airflow to the heat sink. Now to print this thing, there is a lot of sharp corners. So I created a 0.2 millimeter pad on all the corners it could to help it print. Let's see the result. It's printed out without any warping issue, but actually it did on the top bar, it got, but you can barely see it. If the model is printed out higher in between, we'll still have the problems. But this one, no problems at all, no warping at all. Because I create a small pad of this preventer. But of course, you, you, you may think, how do I remove it? It's actually very easy. First thing, push on it. Use your finger or put, use anything, push on it. Get the white shape out. When you push on it, the shape will become white color. It's really easy to find out where is the location of that spot you want to move out. You just push them in, push them in, then you can just peel it off. But of course, in between, in, in the middle one, you may need some tools on it. But so you push them in and peel it off. Um, and this part, peel it off. Very easy, right? Looks so easy. And peel it off. Uh, in, of course, in middle one, you need to some time. You need to find a way to, to move that. Maybe you need some tools. Uh, or you know, you can just push it in and pull it off. Peel it off. Okay, the first part, take out. This, uh, this is the support. By doing this, also you need to understand. You need to know what your models look like. So easy to help you to move that out. Push it in, push it in, and it off. This is the models, and uh, of course, you will, I will use some knife to sh to clean it up at the end. Still will still got a little bit well, when the base is not running well. But this is not critical. This model is not perfect, but still can use without problems. Tips is uh, if you see after you peel it off, it got some white color shape, or you sand it or bend it, it will always got white color shape in the APS print. I'm using this. You can use any hot blow gun, even uh maybe your hair blower, so it should be fine. Heat it up. Heat it up, get some. Then you can you see the white line there? Blow it. Be careful, don't blow it over. You can overheat it, it will melt down. But you see the black, the black color is gone. The black color is gone directly. You see that? I'm not sure whether you see it or not, but you can make, move, remove the light, what the white line. What you see it now is a reflection. It's not the actual white light. What I see. You can just use some heat air to remove the white color compared to this and this, you see? And this one, remove it. This is the second tip I use on ABS print. Every time I sand it down, I found that they always got some white color thing. Just heat it a little bit, then it will be gone. The models look nice and they got new model. So, next video, I think I will make, I will make another tutorial how to replace this new part to the printer itself stay tuned if you like this video or you think these tips is help to fix something give me a thumb up subscribe my channel i will share all tip all my tips in future videos see you next time